Hi, today on Wendy Drinks Gin, I've got a new one. So still continuing my way down this menu. Um, today it's beautiful outside and um, what I have is Gin Sol, S-U-L. It's an ultra small batch gin from Hamburg. Portuguese lemons and native botanicals are distilled in tiny 100 liter batches. Um, it's served with thyme and lemon. It's so far, that's just my gin and um, got some juniper berries in there. It's very lovely. Um, it's it's a little, it's not as smooth as some gins, but um, it tastes like gin. It has got a little harsher edge to it to me than, than some of them, most of them I've tried. And I have the Indian tonic water, uh, Franklin and Sons. Mm, yeah, that's nice. Beautiful. What would I drink it with? And you know, I don't even know. Eric asked me the other day, oh, when he heard me talking about um, pairing it with something, he said, oh, did they do that with you? I was like, I have no idea <laughs> if they do or not. I'm just kind of throwing what I hear about wines and with, you know, my, um, <laughs> unprofessional gin reviews and um, but but honestly I, when I drink it I, I do think about how would I enjoy this with the meal and I love food and like most of them I think this gym would go with anything any food any snack except for sweet I'm not sure how it would like you know a cake or a dessert or something like that. I'm not so sure about that pairing, but I'm more of a salty uh, person anyway, so give me some peanuts, some chips. So yeah, I think it would be fine with anything. Or like I'm doing today, I am just having just the gin and sitting outside in the beautiful sunshine. So again, my recommendation, if you're eating and you want this gin, I recommend it. If you're not eating, recommend it. If you're snacking, recommend it. I don't think it would go well with sweets though. Mm, maybe fruit. But I'd say stick to salty or a meal. This is Wendy and we're drinking gin today. Cheers. Until next time.